what's poppin everybody i hope you guys are having a great week in this video i want to talk about target stock and lemonade stock two option plays that i am looking at so these are short-term option plays next week expiration quick in and out we're going to be holding for multiple days but not to multiple weeks and i did uh enter in some options already so we will be getting started in that and in this video i want to go with the basic and the simple psychology uh, of my analysis and what i am taking a look at so first let's start with target stock let's go to the daily time frame and we have this amazing psychological setup for target I entered in a December 1st expiration, 130 contracts sitting around $223. Just take a look at the daily time frame and how we are consolidating. The uh, psychology on here is absolutely insane. We have the 131 level, which we keep rejecting, but this is a massive, massive level. And then we have a uh, support down below, which is going to be our stop loss. So if we come back down below this area, we are bearish. So I'm going to color this line green, and then we are bullish above 131, which is our breakout area. So depending upon how target closes, it's going to look even more bullish. How the candlestick looks right now with this hammer it looks very, very bullish. So if we can close right around the 131 area, and then at market open, we can have that high volume pump right at market open, or even potentially gap up so i already did enter in contracts as alerted on discord as well as x and i absolutely just love this setup for a continuation play if we're up two percent tomorrow you don't want to take in profits uh i want it to be a quick in and quick out um as for our price target we have a resistance around 135 as our price target so that is going to be our price target we also did gap up because of the earnings so we're going to potentially see a continuation into kind of that earnings news and have that continuation to the upside and then take profits at 135 or even take profits tomorrow if we have a green day the next stock that i want to talk about is lemonade this is a 16 dollar stock and it has a 30% short float. Now I'm taking a look at Lemonade. I already got in some options on Lemonade also. Um, I got December 8th expiration. And then I had some uh, as I alerted on Discord. Which I'm down around 80% on it right now. But I did average down. But I'm taking a look at Lemonade. Uh, Target does look better. But with Lemonade it's going to be a, a couple more day hold because it needs to get tighter and con consolidate a little bit more the thing about target is look at how tight it is okay look at how tight just take a look at the candlestick and the psychology as i went over in our course learn to trade that vip so make sure to check um, that out but the psychology on here is insane and the next two candlesticks are really going to decide if we break out or not but with lemonade we still have some more time going on here. We still have some more room. So I got December 8th expiration um, for Lemonade. It is a 30% short float stock. Now, just like um, uh, Target stock, we have our stop loss where we are bearish below. And then we have our breakout area. We want to be bullish above uh, $18. So I got in December 18th expiration. Our price target is around 24 The thing about Lemonade is... It's a short float stock. It's a $14, uh, $16 stock. So once it starts to run, it runs nicely, especially if it has volume. And we did, we do have some nice volume going on here. So I do like this setup. I see this as, you know, if our analysis is right, we can potentially see, you know, a 40% on shares if we get that breakout with volume because it's a stock like amc or, or game stock it's a small cap stock so once it 
gets that attention, it's going to move really nice. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We had Lemonade stock and we have Target stock, both uh, short-term option plays for day trades and swing trades for multiple days. Let's see what happens tomorrow. It's going to be very, very interesting. I'm very excited on both of these plays. And let me know in the comments what you guys think and see you guys tomorrow. Take care.